Oh. Yeah, uh, could I get a few Mystery Vault boxes, please, delivered to the Hypixel server? Yeah, pretty quickly. My username is DanTDM. Awesome, thank you. They said no. <laughs> Everyone, Dan here from the Zyma Minecraft. Welcome back to another Minecraft video where today we are back on Hypixel and let's see if they delivered them. Yes, they said no, but they were joking. Yes, we have a lot of mystery vault boxes. Oh my goodness, look how many we've got. We have a five star one as well. Whoa, we have a five star, three star, one star. There's another five star in there as well. Oh, jeez. I'm going to open up a five-star one. We've got a few five-stars. Okay, which one should I open? Let's go for this one. We could get a slime block, baby black sheep, a creeper morph, or a magma cube pet. Ooh, let's see. Here we go. Let's open up this box and see what happens. I'm so glad that phone call works. Here we go. Look, three, two, one. Oh, my goodness. I never even noticed that before. That looks so cool. Here we go. Five-star chest. What's it going to contain? What's it going to... Oh, jeez. Ah, what is this? Who are these? Who are these guys? What? What? What is going on? Um, <laughs> where did you guys come from? Um, hello, uh, oh jeez, I hit him. I hit him. He's mad. He's mad. Why are there Dan TDM zombies in here? I have no idea what's going on, guys. But what did we win? We want a rare light blue sheep pet and 31 pet items. Awesome. Let's see if we can grab that pet, shall we? Here he is. Look at him. Oh, he's a level one. Beautiful. So, what? Oh, am I riding him? Oh, yes. Yes, look at me. I want my sheep. Oh, geez. These mystery boxes are absolutely amazing. I love them. But anyway, that's not what we're here to do today. At the beginning of every Hypixel video, I'm now going to open a mystery chest because they're super fun. But today, we're going to be playing some more pixel painters. I've got two suggestions from you guys. Let's do this. Um, did you see that? <laughs> that pig just stuck to my arm. Anyway, let's go. Here we go. And the first theme that we are going to be taking a look at today is... Ice cream, and this was suggested by Elijah M, and I really like your use of emojis, bro. That looks really cool. So, let's draw an ice cream. Now, what I'm gonna do here is something kind of ironic. I want to make a snowman holding an ice cream, so I'm gonna need some kind of background that's not gonna interfere with my white snowman. I think I'm gonna go for blue. And then we're gonna grab um, a snowman-shaped brush. So let's do this. Okay, we're gonna make the snowman pretty big. How big are we going to make his face? We need it so we can make enough detail on his face with a carrot for his nose. It's going to be the greatest snowman ever to have lived. Ever. I promise you. Okay, let's do this. Right. Let's do a fill-in of this and this. There we go. And now we need to do some details. Let's use the pencil for this, actually. Let's go for a dot here. And then we're going to make uh, a little eye, a little beady eye. There we go. Another little beady eye here. Oh, geez. That's kind of cute already. <laughs> and then we're going to make a carrot. So let's do a carrot for his nose. This is going to come out about here. So it's kind of going to be like a derpy Olaf, pretty much. There we go. That's looking good. I'm actually liking that. Okay, let's put this in here. Fill that in too. And then we need like a darker orange. A slightly darker orange. And then we'll go for... Yeah, there we go. Put some lines across this carroty nose. Yeah, that's actually looking pretty cool. Okay, and now we just need the, um, the mouth. Now, do I do the mouth as a solid bit or shall I do it as like dots? Let's, uh, let's just do it as a solid bit. That makes sense. Look how happy he is. Oh, he's so cute. Right, let's, uh, make the ice cream now. Do I want to do it as... Yeah, let's do it like this. Okay. Right, the ice cream is gonna be pretty big. So let's do a big cone. There we go. Fill that bad boy in. That's a good color for a cone, actually. And then we're gonna do different scoops. I'm gonna do a strawberry one. So let's do strawberry over here. And it's gonna kind of be dripping down the side as well. There we go. So let's do that, and then fill that in. Hopefully that looks good. Otherwise, yep, yeah, that looks okay. And I like the drip as well. And then we're going to do a... Let's do like a yellow flavor too. There we go. And before I fill that one in, I need a brown so I can do a chocolate one. And we're going to do this here. There we go. Looking good. Very nice indeed. Let's fill that in. And then let's fill this one in. Oh, that's looking kind of cool. I'm surprised with my ability here. <laughs> Very surprised. Now, I'm going to just quickly shade it up. Just like this. Actually, that looks kind of pink. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, what about this? Does that look better? Kind of? Okay, we're just going to have to leave it like that. And then we're going to do his arm coming out this way. Because he needs to be holding this. So his arm is going to be there. His thumb is going to be here. And he's going to have like a couple fingers there too. Yeah, looking good, Mr. Snowman. He's holding his ice cream cone. Now, what can I do in the background? I've got one minute to go. 
Um, I guess I could do a little bit more shading, I guess. Yeah, that, that looks okay. What about a little bit darker on the yellow? There we go. And the brown can't really get any darker, to be honest. So we're going to have to leave that like that. I want to do a little bit of shading on the snowman. Let's do that. There we go. I'm all about the shading, guys. All about the shading. There we go. Nice. This snowman's actually pretty cute. I'm going to undo that one, though. There we go. Let's do it all the way around this time. There. That's better. Okay. We, we've done the snowman. Now, can we do, like, snowflakes, maybe? That might be a good one to do. Let's do a little bit of snowflake here. Snowflake here. Snowflake here. Snowflake here. And there. And there. And we are done. You know what? I am loving that. That's one of my favorite ones I've done so far. Oh, geez. Right. Let's see what everyone else has created. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> Hopefully, that looks like an ice cream. It, it's, it's a bit melty, but hey, that's fine. Let's see what everyone else has done. Here we go. Oh, that one on the bottom left is great. It's so good. I like that. It's got loads of detail in the cone. I'm liking that. And they've done the circles as well. I think they used the circle tool. I've never used the circle tool before. I'm all about that free hand. But can we win? The bottom right one, it's a draw. What? We got beaten by that? I don't usually get mad, but what? What just happened there? What just happened? Oh, my goodness. Right. Let's, uh, let's vote for another one. I'm going to go for bottom right. Oh, gee. Oh, my goodness. All those votes just came pouring in then. Um, oh man, look at this. It looks like a table tennis paddle. Uh, that kind of looks like a fruit bowl. I'm gonna go top left. I can't believe we got beaten by that little triangle. What is going on here? Did that really just win? Oh my goodness, this? I have no idea what happened here. We've got, um, this one. It's a nice melty ice cream. This one is swimming, I think. <laughs> it's getting eaten by a shark. That's what it looks like anyway. But this one is a deserved winner. Okay, um... <laughs> What happened here? How? What? 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 What is going on? What is going on? I have no idea what's going on. Okay, right. The one on the right one. Oh! What? I don't remember winning. This is completely random. I have no idea what's going on. I thought we got beaten in that one. Oh, well. I'm not complaining. Let's see if we can win this after all. Oh, geez. Let's come from behind and win this one. We're in the finals somehow. I have no idea how. Come on. We can win. Don't let this table tennis racket win. No. No, come on. Oh, it's drawing. We're drawing. One more vote. Yes. Yes. Oh, from nowhere. No, wait. Is it draw? It's a draw. Oh, yes. Oh, that's me, by the way. I didn't say what my nickname was. My nickname was Let's Eat Cake. We won. That was so close. How did, what? How did someone know? Look, wait. Was Dan here? How do they know that? I know I've got a skin, but geez. Oh, my goodness. They, they knew. I can't even use the disguise anymore. Oh, man. You guys are too smart. <laughs> okay, let's see if anyone else cracks the code of my name. So my name I forgot to mention was Let's Eat Cake. I'm pretty sure we lost one of those rounds, but then ended up winning the whole thing. I have no idea how that happened, but I am perfectly happy with that, of course. Wow. <laughs> I can't believe people figured out why I am. I just need to change my skin as well. I can't believe it. Anyway, let's get into this next one. And the next theme is a pretty a cool one. Because I've had a certain suggestion. I've set the theme as... As come on, D there we go, dinosaur. And this was suggested by Cornell Shuhatorno. Man, you guys have some complex names sometimes. He said, "Do dinosaurs using a crown?" Which I think I mean is wearing a crown. So I put the theme as dinosaur, and then we will make our dinosaur in particular wear a crown. Now, what color should I do the dinosaur? I'm tempted just to go for green, but I'm also tempted not to go for green. I'm gonna go for green because otherwise I'm gonna spend way too long thinking about it. Right, we need. A really happy dinosaur. I'm thinking kind of like... Um, oh, what is his name? What's his name from Toy Story? The guy from Toy Story. I'm thinking that. There we go. <laughs> what is going on with this guy's head? Um, let's do some little arms as well. There we go. And I might be able to fit another one in. I'm not too sure. No, I'm not going to be able to fit another one in. Okay, let's do some uh, teeths as well. There we go. Oh, that actually looks quite funny. Oh, geez, this is going to be funny. Uh, and I need to do a crown for him as well. So let's pop that there. And then we're going to do a little beady eye. Now, can we do a tiny little beady eye just here? Yes, we can. Okay, that might look... Uh, wait, undo that. Uh, what about... Does this look better? Yeah, that looks better. Okay, this is the happy dinosaur right now. And we're going to do a little bit of green around here too, like his belly. There we go. Let's fill that in. Boom. And how am I going to do his claws? I guess you could do, like, grey claws. Just to make sure that people know that these are his hands. There we go. They're kind of okay. They're terrible, actually. I'm undoing those straight away. Undo. 
Undo. Undo. Let's just do little spikes on there. That's better. Jeez, those other ones were terrible. Let's do this. There we go. And what else? We need the party hat. Or is that... No, it was the crown, wasn't it? Okay, we're going to do the crown. Let's choose a gold color. Let's do the crown down here. There we go. And then we need the crown, like, going up. And then around like this. It's actually pretty hard to draw a crown. It's harder than I thought it would be. But hey, we're going to put major detail into this crown. It's going to be the best crown you've ever seen. So, yeah, we've got the pencil tool. Let's make it a little bit more thick on these edges. There we go. So those are like the two outy bits. And then we're going to make another outy bit up here. I'm not even sure what to call them. What are they even called on a crown? There we go. So he's wearing a crown. And we need some white. Just to put some like fuzz around the edge. There we go. And we're going to make that... Oh, man. Why did I have to do that? Let's go for an eraser. Get rid of uh, that. I want to get rid of it. There we go. Okay. I want to make it so that there's like jewels on it. But I need white. A little bit more white. Yeah, there we go. That's better. That's better. And then we want some jewels. Let's go for some red ones. So I'm going to put one there, 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 there. Uh, and let's put some light blue ones on as well. One minute to go. Jeez, I spent way too long on this one. And I need some, some shading too, just to make it look a little bit more royal. There we go. He's wearing a crown. He's King Dinosaur. Do not mess with King Dinosaur, okay? Uh, what about... Oh, jeez. Um, I need to do some, like, nostrils. There we go. There's a nostril. <laughs> that looks terrible. And then we're going to do some shading. Real quick. I've got 30 seconds. 30 seconds to go. I need to do a background, too. What am I going to do for the background? Um, oh, jeez. What can I do? I'm just going to fill it in blue for now. Let's just do that. Um, oh, jeez. Wait, 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 wait. I've got a perfect idea. Uh, let's go... Let's just do H... I like this. There we go. I was going to do a speech bubble, but that, my friends, is my king dinosaur. I think he's looking pretty cool. That was an awesome suggestion, Cornell, by the way. Let's see what everyone else has drawn for their dinosaur. Because I kind of left it out there in the open, but I had a little bit more of a specific brief. That is not what we asked for. It's very detailed, but that's not what we asked for, was it? Okay, let's go for... This bottom left one is pretty cute. Oh, yes, we're getting love. We're getting love. Please don't say every anyone knows who I am. Look at that. The votes are coming in. Oh, geez, right. Um, Which one should we choose? I quite like this one. This one's really cute. I like his little arms. <laughs> that's really cool. Oh, man. Dinosaur can actually be quite a hard one as well. So hopefully people are able to draw it. Yeah, we've got some good ones this time. Look at the amount of teeth this guy has. I'm going for that guy. His teeth are amazing. Actually, I might... Can I change mine? Oh, I'm locked in. Oh, no, I locked in this one. Yeah, I kind of like this one. The proportions are pretty good. Nice brown dinosaur. And that that's not a dinosaur, unfortunately. So we're going to go for this one at the bottom. He's crying a pink tear, unfortunately. <laughs> right, semi-finals. Up next. Oh, no, more elimination. Jeez, uh, I like the top right one. That is cute. I like it a lot. <laughs> we're going to go for that one. The top left one is a little bit scary. A little bit scary. Now, it should be the semi-finals now, I think. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, semi-finals. Me against the crying pink tear dinosaur. I think we're doing okay. I kind of messed up the shading at the bottom. I kind of hate that. <laughs> but look how many votes we've got. How many people are in this game? Oh, my goodness. Destroyed it. And these are very similar. I'm going to go for... Yeah, I think the left one is the best. We're going to go for the less one. Uh, let's eat cake, someone says. Don't you dare reveal who I am. Don't you do it. Right, is this a final? It's a final. Oh, jeez. Let's eat cake. Let's eat cake. Come on. Yes, the dinosaur is winning. Does this mean we get two in a row? Two first places in a row? I think it might be. Look at all these hearts. All these hearts everywhere. Four let's eat cake. Yes. <laughs> GG, guys. GG. Oh, man. I can't believe we just did that. Oh, we got a two-star mystery box. We can open that in the next video. But for now, I'm going to ride my sheep off into the distance. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I can't believe we won two in a row again. That is so awesome. We had a... What did we have? A snowman eating an ice cream and also King Dinosaur. So thank you for your suggestions. As always, leave your suggestions in the comment section down below. And you might have a chance for your comments to be featured in the next video. But apart from that, if you did enjoy today's drawings, then please leave a big fat thumbs up. That would be greatly appreciated. And also, if this happens to be the first video, that you've ever seen by me, then please do consider subscribing to join Team TDM today for more Minecraft fun. Thank you again so much for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye!